guys welcome back to my channel or if you're new welcome my name is Monica and today I'm doing kind of a fun different video all about companies that don't make makeup but that I wish that they would I have four companies here um, I just took some notes I kind of came up with some ideas and they're all companies that don't do makeup at all but that when I see them I see inspiration for like products that I would definitely want to buy and it's, I mean it's a little bit of a strange idea but I had a whole lot of fun like coming up with companies that like I love that I wish would come out with like certain makeup products so I threw together four companies a couple of products I would love to see from them and you know I just had a lot of fun putting all this together so I thought I would tell you guys what companies they were and or what I wish they would come out with so before we jump into the video don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you like unique videos like this and you want to see any more in the future and don't forget to subscribe hit the little bell icon so you're notified whenever I post a new video so let's jump right in if you see me looking down I'm looking at my phone because I have all my notes like in a Google Doc down here <laughs> so the first company I wish would also make makeup is Apple yes Apple the tech giant <laughs> but whenever I use like a MacBook or whenever I see like the the Apple logo like I think that would look stunning on a compact just like like take my MacBook and just think like a circle right here around the Apple and just imagine that as a compact it would be gorge so anyway the makeup that I want to see from Apple is a highlighter I think Apple like with the just stark white bright stores that they have all of like their slim sleek products i think they would come out with the most blinding highlight ever i think that would be a whole lot of fun oh, i just like i i thought about this this is what actually spawned this video i was like oh what if apple made a highlighter and i sat and i was like oh my god that'd be incredible it would be like not silver but it would be blinding <laughs> and you'd have a beautiful compact and I just ah oh, I had so many ideas of how it would look <sighs> and now I'm like sad in my heart that I know like 99% chance it's never going to be made but how cool would that be like a highlighter from Apple it probably cost a bajillion dollars like let's be real <laughs> but it would be cool <laughs> The next company that I would love to see makeup from is Starbucks. Now, what I really want to see from Starbucks is a coffee scented bronzer. If Too Faced can come out with chocolate scented ones with cocoa powder and everything, I'm sure they could do the same thing with coffee. I just really want to open up like a Starbucks compact and just get a waft of coffee beans. How incredible would that be? And then it's like the perfect bronzer. They come out with shades all across the spectrum. It would be like the Starbucks logo on the front of the compact. Oh, I really want it. <laughs> oh, Happy Me is kind of upset with coming up with these ideas because I know they're never going to happen. But how incredible would that be? I would use the help out of a bronzer from Starbucks. So in addition to that coffee bronzer, I would love to see an eyeshadow palette from Starbucks because they are all about the greens and about the browns. I would love to see kind of like the Natasha Denona like green brown palette but like a smaller version from Starbucks. I think that would be incredible. Focus on the greens and the emeralds. Focus on the browns. Focus on the scent too. Like if that could smell like coffee too, we'd be in business. Ah. Ah. So I just, I just really want coffee scented makeup and I want it from Starbucks. Let's just We'll put it at that. The next company I want to see makeup from is Barnes & Noble. Kind of going off of the storybook cosmetics like theme of like the book palettes, I think Barnes & Noble could take that and run with it. Could you imagine how many different book eyeshadow palettes they could come out with? Honestly, like the two palettes I want to see are a Great Gatsby eyeshadow palette, because look at this cover. It's gorgeous. Imagine the blues. Imagine the golds. It's just, uh, I just really want an entire like set or collection of eyeshadow palettes based on all the Harry Potter books. I'm talking about like the original covers in the US. The original US covers. They all had different color schemes. They all, oh my god, they were so artistic. They just blended in so many different elements. And I think if you made each one of those into an eyeshadow palette and then sold them as a set, like the book set that they have, 
oh my god i would just keep that on my vanity and you would only need like that because you've got like the neutral cover of the first book you go all the way to the green a goblet of fire you can go into the blues of the order of the phoenix like i really want this eyeshadow palette set that i just made up <laughs> that's really what i want to see i want to see great gatsby and i want to see harry potter and the last company that I really want to see makeup from, I know it wouldn't be as exciting as the rest of them, but Uniqlo. If you don't know Uniqlo, Uniqlo is a Japanese clothing store slash brand that is kind of like in between the Gap and Express for clothing. So you have a lot of work appropriate clothing, you've got a lot of like cardigans, you've got a lot of um, work appropriate dresses, work appropriate skirts. They have a lot of their basics like tank tops, pajamas, house shoes, like all of your basics are covered by Uniqlo. And I think it would be incredible to see them come out with a basic line of like neutral, work appropriate makeup. Because how amazing would it be to go into one store, you can get all of your nice like work appropriate like clothing, and then get like a nice foundation, a nice concealer, get a neutral eyeshadow palette, get all of your basic necessities for your wardrobe but then also for your makeup ultimately i would really love to see like an affordable collection of your basics like what do you think of when you think of your makeup basics you think of foundation you think of concealer you think of maybe your brows you think of maybe the perfect nude lip i would love to see a lipstick collection hopefully liquid lipstick of just a huge range of neutral so everyone could find their perfect nude lip for work that's the dream. <sighs> That's the dream. So those are the four companies that I would love to see come out with makeup. I know 99.99999% chance that none of this is going to happen, but I had a whole lot of fun just thinking up ideas and putting all of this together. Let me know down below if there are any companies that you would love to see come out with makeup and what you wanna see them come out with. And also if anyone else wants to do like the same video idea, please do, please tag me, please let me know. I would love to see your videos and I wanna see like the creativity flowing. And maybe if, you know, this gets enough traction, we could try to like make our own like dupe palettes for like our fantasy palettes, but that'll be in the future. So again, thank you so much for watching. I hope if you like this video, you'll go ahead and hit the thumbs up button and subscribe before you leave. And I hope I'll see you in my next video. Bye.